This just in, Holy Joe's season two is returning. Over to you, Jake. I'm good, <laughs> Unique New York. Unique New York. I love scotch. Scotchy, scotch, scotch. <laughs> I'm Matt Morley. Local Fort Wayneian. <laughs> Yeah, I'm Jake Hoffman. Uh, I started attending First Pres about a year ago, um, so I just really wanted to... Uh... I'm Matt Morley, First Pres member. Are you like a tourist? Are you Sagittarius? I'm Matt Morley. Uh, I came to Holy Joe's because, um, you know, Tony talked about it in the uh, in church one day. And I thought, you know what, I haven't, this is when we had first kind of started visiting First President and joined officially yet. Um, after uh, the last two years that we've had, and then before that, I was on the road a lot. So um, ever since I moved to Fort Wayne, I hadn't really had a good community to rely on, like a close-knit community. Um, everyone I knew it was either family or people that I worked with. And so I just want to kind of expand on that. First and foremost was, so my reasons for going were kind of just selfishly wanting more friends, I guess. And and so it was good for that. And then I ended up getting way more than that. And we were able to get a little deeper into it for, for certain things and, and connecting with people um, uh, on different levels and, and in different ways was, it happened very quickly and that was really cool, I thought. All right, my name is Jake Huffman. Um, I came to First Pres about a year ago, um, just looking for connections. Um, I got approached about Holy Joe's and just felt like this was a great opportunity to, to meet more people, to kind of have a safe group to be myself and be, be true to who I am and get to know more people and just kind of experience that bond that you don't really get out in the real world. Mm -hmm. um, so it's kind of just a unique opportunity to come and just be yourself and be comfortable with who you are and share more with, with guys in a way that you don't really get out in the, the real world very often. So it was kind of a cool opportunity. Mm -hmm. I can't do it. <laughs> um, so probably the, the thing that makes me most excited for, looking forward to our next uh, kind of time together um, is building off of the surprising relationships that uh, I formed. Like I, I was most surprised by um, not the fact that I connected with people, but who I connected with, and the multi generational connection was very fruitful. I thought, and getting connect, getting to connect to people who are um, older have have more life experience and can not only be your friend, but also then pour some wisdom into you. Um, that was, uh, I think, the biggest surprise of, of the first um, time that we met together and what I hope we build on in the future and, and going forward. So yeah, so looking forward to the next adventure with Holy Joe's. I'm really looking forward to the continued camaraderie. What? Is that a word? Camaraderie, yes. Camaraderie? Mm -hmm. We're gonna retake that. <laughs> um, so for our next adventure with Holy Joe's, I'm just really looking forward to the continued bonding that we had. It's been a great experience. We just gather over some food and some drinks and just get to know mm -hmm. each other on a deeper level. Um, I think it's really important to, just to, to grow as not only men itself, but just as a brotherhood of sorts. Absolutely. Um, so I think it's just been a great, great time. And I really look forward to continuing that. And just seeing how we grow together and then how we continue to grow Holy Joe's and the church community as a whole. Yes. yes. I concur. After the break, weather with Jake. Oh, you're Jake. Oh,